All right, guys. Sorry, I thought it was loud. Um, I was right at my mic. Uh, welcome back to PG Tour 2K21, and let's go ahead and get our sponsor ready since we did get some clubs there. And let's see, we're pretty. We need another thousand for Callaway. Eight fifty for TaylorMade. I would like the wedges for Callaway. We can only get 600 at the most. We'll go to Callaway since all we got was a stupid hat last time. Um, three rounds with no bogeys. Oh, come on, man. It's ridiculous. Try the medium one. And if we can get it, um, we'll need to do one more Callaway contract, just a small one. And we'll get something. Let's shoot. Uh, Next month. Actually, I gotta figure out when in the month. It's the Masters. Gotta set that to record, cause... I will... I'm working, I work on Thursday. But then... Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, I'm usually asleep until it's like half over. So... This PGA Tour event brought to you I gotta make sure I record all this stuff because the WGC FedEx St. Jude with the way the golf works, it's like I have Comcast or Xfinity, which, which I'm, I mean, Comcast is Xfinity, so. Um, and it plays on this thing called Peacock, which you get for free if you have Comcast. It plays like the really early stuff, then it plays on Golf Channel. And then it'll play on NBC or a whatever channel it's on. Um, I forgot what we had to do with the sponsor already. This win really kicks up, especially in the hot conditions of summertime. This makes for a very long and challenging day. The greens are small; they can get firm, they can get fast. So finding more than 14 greens a day out here is excellent golf. The I think the NBC or I think it's NBC yeah. is only um, on the weekend. Just like the legendary Elvis, you got to be ready to rock and roll. Thank you. Oh, Thank you very gosh. much. This should be good. Put a little spin on it. See how it unfolds, Rich. This should be an absolute beauty. Oh, short. Wow. Six yeah, miles an hour wind right and it. There. Always like love these opportunities. Ten yards short. When it's for a little weird. But we'll see how. Uh, Birdie the first hole, hell yeah. yeah we'll, take that. we'll see how good they're playing uh, much, on this one. Well, that's a lovely way to get going. And we're tied for the first. There's Justin under Thomas. Making birdie in the first always puts you in a good frame of mood. It'll be fun to watch the round. Yeah, players. we won't uh, be catching him, I don't think. With the FedEx Cup. Ooh, fast. Uh, Dang it. Just sneak off the field. Oh. Yep. I was going to say it could get a good kick, but it did second not. Second shot on the second. Well, let's see, this is a pitch. Heavy rough, so it won't affect it too much. And if we go a little fast, and we went slow. And of course, look at it, 20 yards short when it's yeah, slow. I'll right. say if we go fast, I no, know it'll be perfect the distance. Missing the green was always in the oh, cards. you idiot. Well, I guess it was, actually. Big power saver coming up for this fella. Oh, crap. Good looking putt. You remember when I first started PGA 2K21 and I would just go like a percent or two above what they wanted and it would like pop out of the hole and now you can go a couple percent, five percent over or something and uh, you're still good. Yeah. I remember 2K. Glad they fixed their mistake though. Oh, I thought that was going to hit a cart path. The tree. 
Not too bad lion and mulch. Three hybrid. It's a little worse lie, but it should be okay. Tab it. Looks to be going really? to the hybrid here. Ah, uh, that always looked red, didn't it? <sighs> their Whatever, shot. man. Straight that tad little bit Tough slow to made it go in the water. The Whatever, man. Look at the line on this we'll one. get away with the par. The but that should have been an Perfect. easy birdie on this hole. hole. And the putt drops, and we're moving on. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. The fourth hole here at TPC Southwind is the first par three on the course, and it measures just under 200 yards. Just avoid the penalty area to the left. What? It was downhill. Approach. Grab the putter from the caddy. You're dancing. Outside chance of the bird. And it's only nine. But here is still good. What? Whatever. I, I knew I put too much break on that. I was just yeah, that was slightly I was just pissed at the shot. Sometimes you try I don't know. They you know, you just forget they the seem to think wind is just a concrete course. wall or something. It just Sunday stops the ball from moving now. forward. I don't, I don't understand it. The fifth, the it's not that seven seven strong. Nine seven miles seven an hour should not affect it like that. Yards. It requires a good strong drive to Especially a... Uh, and then an accurate approach what would I hit? A six iron? Yeah, no more now I'm gonna affect it that from about 220 yards out. Only two shots off the pace. A little slow, it's gonna be in a rough. Nothing good out on the right hand side, Luke. Would have been this decent if it wasn't slow, I guess. Getting or if the wind didn't two um, take it like lead. that. Ah, I didn't or did I? Yeah, I didn't want to hit it full. Seven feet to but, the top. Oh, wonderful effort. Confirms the oh, I thought that was a par 5. Because we hit a wood in, but I forget R5 what only goes the strategy at the six 215. Yeah, this par 4. That's 450. That should find the fairway. Sitting at one under in a share of second spot. No fast. No slow. Okay. But it was okay. A wonderful shot. Well wow. A I was terrified that was going to be a seven footer right here. fast and it was going to be left oh, off the, the green. And, that will take him to and I just two noticed one. left would have taken it probably 15 of yards off. At stage. The seventh at TPC Southwind is a strong par four measuring 482 yards from Slow. the back tee. Yeah. A big clump of trees on the left and the one on the right is to be avoided off the tee. Also, oh, a good angle to attack bad. this green is from the left half of the I can't make it. With a huge greenside tree that also affects any poor approaches. So, I think we're going to go just trying to loft this one over the trees. Going with the eight iron here. This oh, come on. Might roll into the rough. This lie won't be too bad in the first cut. Oh. There we go. Get a par save. Played, mate. And he needs this to save par. Ooh, nice line. All right. That's well hold. At minus two, coming along nicely today. Beyond and the half. I don't know how you say his name. I'm sorry, man. A really nice short par three, measuring just right. Knowing the wind. Yards. This green has been recently contoured, so accuracy. Little D lock. I mean, yeah, D lock with some spin on it. And of Game course, seven. that's. Look how far right that's that went. Sure. Come on. Yeah, it was barely on slow, approach. and I adjusted. A little less club on that approach. For the wind. Oh, perfect. I thought I was going to hit it fast Ooh, and have it go left, so I left, left it where I was at. Oh, a lovely opportunity to save par here. But Jesus, and that's a way to I don't know if the, the slow, well the tiny the little bit slow it was, was what affected well it going about 15 yards right, the finishing hole on the front or the 8 mile an hour barely to the right lane. Towards a dog leg right. 
There's a big body of water, the short front left of this green. So make sure you've got enough club to reach Dang the it. surface. I was really thinking I'd hit that fast. That's an awful error. Sitting at two under, just behind the leader. Nine iron actually should be good. Unless I'm gonna hit this tree. Unless I do that. Oh, come back. Oh, it, it didn't come back as far as I wanted, yeah, but luckily it was the Slim chance here for right Birdie, distance. But you never know. Yeah, you never know. Looking you really just never know. Oh, absolute <laughs> I had no bogey so far, and so that's good. We managed to make some really good and par saves. One more look at that shot. We'll see after making a miraculous recovery from under a tree in the heavy rough. I managed to make a two foot break into the right, All right Rich, uphill. Made the turn now into the what final nine. Tied what for the so far. <laughs> yeah, exciting position, isn't it? You'd rather have the lead on your Ooh, own. Look at that creek. Tie for the lead. Pretty good spot to be in. They're going to have to work to earn this victory. Wind should keep us from yeah. this one. going anywhere near it. From around 140 yards here. Wind is blowing from right to left here. Wants to work it against hmm. the wind. Eight miles an hour. Yeah, if we work against it, be right there. Put some spin. Choosing Hit that the perfect. Come on, here. wind. Uh, this one's heading towards the rough, I think. You screwed me over every That's time. Why not now? Had a chance to hit the green, but you couldn't help couldn't me this time. And looking for the fade, but finding the straight shot. Not good. Shut up. Sit. Wow. Wow, All that right. almost went in the hole. I really didn't think I was going to go that far. And this one is for his par. Their short game has been very Yes, it has. It's the only reason we're under par, to be honest. All day long because of it. Currently at three under. Oh, I think the there's two Koreans with me. The par 3 11th at TPC Something you don't see often. Measures just 162 yards. The looks can be deceiving here. While it looks pretty, it can bite you. Make sure you've got enough club here on approach. Oh, definitely enough. Definitely enough. Oh, didn't really spin too much. That's tidy. This one's Must be some hard greens because a 9 iron you would think would hey, stop. Oh man, line. didn't hit it. And that should secure the par. Well done. Because it wasn't breaking that much, so I just didn't hit it. Is currently sitting in second. Moving down the leaderboard, Luke, never a good thing. Wait, did I say... The par 4, 12th. There's only a short Shit. one measuring 406 yards from Is the Is that tips. the Korean flag? You need to be very I feel like an idiot right now. Avoid that huge water hazard to the right, and that'll give you the best angle into this green. Any drive that's pushed left will make it a difficult approach, but be wary. There's water over the back of this green. Yeah, I'm pretty sure see. it is. I'm sorry if it's not, guys. And any are watching. I doubt it, but Wow, that was slow. Hit that thing fast as hell. And he's safe on the green with that shot. Ooh, I actually shoot. The card. This okay. <sighs> I went so fast. I didn't it, notice it was breaking more to the right than the left. Well, that was a positive hole. A little shift up the and so I just hit it because I moved it to the right. And I was like, no, it's going to miss to the right. TPC Southwind plays uphill and 472 yards. Jesus. Dustin Johnson once hit a drive here, 375 right. yards, which left just a flick wedge in. It set up a victory. Have you got the power in the tank? That's what it's required God, to make just, a birdie. Playing from around 150 Thinking yards about pretty good win back into the playing a course. Um, like even though this this course is only 200 yards, yards longer than the course I play. But just thinking about another. playing courses that oh really I put too much break on it that have par fours that are 470. It's like. Yeah. I can barely make it to the green with a driver and if I hit a drive 250 I still would have 270 so it's like I couldn't imagine if you need a birdie go flag hunting otherwise lay up to around 20 feet left oh I'm always going flag hunting I'm always going flag hunting that's why I got two hole in ones. Yeah, quality shot that. 
a chance to move to five under par. Let's get it. That was a on the next hole. Attempt. You know. Five feet coming up to the cup. Nice stroke. Nicely hold. And for par. Uh, the par five, the first and par five was on the third hole. The and we don't get to the next one for like another two holes, the 17th is hole, I think. At the par four so I was thinking, just I was like, man, off the tee. Players like to lay where are the par five? I was actually thinking, do, are there any There's par fives on this course? The the oh, come on, you had to roll into the heavy stuff. So make sure your approach is accurate. Mm, John, what's this one looking like? Can't really see our lie. Well, or not a lie, but our deep in this rough. This is gonna slope. take some. Uh, this is gonna take some precision engineering to get out. Pitching wedge with some D loft. Should be good. Hit it perfect. Oh yes, jump. There we go. That's how you play out the rough. Approach shot. Of all the shots that I like the most, that Ooh. one ranks right up there. I knew it. I Ooh, knew right I hit it too hole. hard. I was excited. Right I hit a really good. Way. Really good second shot and just Ooh, powered like through the frickin' three foot putt. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. The 16th at TPC Southwind is the last genuine birdie hole on the course. It's a and we hit it slow into the rough. Yards, but there's a lot just a lot of the shot that's played uphill to a ridge. If you can get it up over the rise, a good chance for reaching the green here in mm -hmm. two to set up a birdie and even perhaps eagle. But be wary of this green. There's a big bunker short left. And if you find it, it's not an easy up and down. Well, maybe even a par can be hard. Jump to the right. I know it's not, but... Oh, on the fringe. Good play there, Rich. Well, we only had a five iron in. Sitting out so, I mean, not four. bad. Currently leading. Right, you don't want to go full oh, oh, so close. when they're off the green. Lining up the birdie putt here. Because they will. I mean, they'll just go 15 feet, 20 feet back. At the top of the and with that, they'll move to five under par. Our current leader is enjoying a two stroke lead. The play so far has been stellar, increasing hmm. the lead, Luke. But can they maintain it? I think we should be good. I don't think we'll reach the creek Luke or the heavy. The oh no, we def. Oh wow. Luke. Never mind. Unfortunately, that got a horrible kick. Ended up in the rough. Well, it wasn't really the kick. It was. Well, to become the champion at TPC Southwind, you need to. I didn't think we could get there, and we did. And there's none tougher than this approach into 17. Well, the, the approach the isn't hard. It's just below the player, flanked by bunkers both right and left. The green is long and narrow, and does generally move from right to left. All in all, one of the most difficult approaches oh, on I this Oh, I forgot I was on course. the fringe. Okay. I just played too much break. That wasn't your best effort, was it? Yeah, like, I knew it was too much. There was no... It was breaking the this whole way, which is why I put so much break on it. Well hold. But there was really no huge break now, in the putt the like there would be, you know, if you needed to put it that far out. But. The finishing hole at TPC Southwind is an absolute mm. beauty. There's been some heroic moments like hole out eagles, and there's been triple bogeys that have cost championships. Your job is to get the ball safely into the fairway here. If you're not a long driver, don't take on the corner. But if you can, it'll leave you just a short iron in, a chance to seal the victory with a bird. Does that count as being a long driver? And this shot here coming up from around 130 yards. Play with our gap wide a little bit. Let's see, we got, it's going left on the slope, but the wind's going to do more to it. Tad bit of deal off, because I know this eight mile an hour wind isn't going to carry it that whole way. That should find the surface. Wow. Shouldn't have put that deal off. Yeah, nicely played. School card filled with threes never hurts. Good putt to Didn't make hit this. It. Uh, oh, just missed. Bogey free round though on the first the round of a major is not bad. Minus five. So there you have it in the house in top spot after the opening round. Everyone likes to get off to a fast start, and they certainly have. And that's a good place in the to lead be by one. The first round, but listen, there's lots of golf to be played. Multiple rounds, they still have to navigate Against through. But Sung JM and Bayong Han Ah. Well, he's minus three, but well, just Danny Lee at minus two, Australia, oh, no, Australian. For in. Look to your company next time. Yeah, Australian. Louis Oosthuizen. Justin Thomas finishes plus one. Is he not the beast he once was? After the update, maybe? 
I did see that the update... I guess they tried to fix the, um... The highlights, which I have off. Um... I don't know if I'm gonna get the putts of 1.3 because I keep leaving them pretty far out and two putting. Um, wait, what was I saying? Oh my god, I just forgot what I was saying. 2K Sports delighted to bring you all the action here for the PGA Tour. We're at the World Golf Championships FedEx St. Oh, Invitational. No. Today's ah, I forgot. I don't know. To start. No Delay idea. Have your company for this second round action. I'm Luke Elvey alongside Slow. Rich Beam and Rich. As this player starts their round okay. in the lead, what should be their focus for today? Well, I think that uh, the chances are pretty good. The good thing about having a small lead is you have an opportunity to make it a bigger lead, and you want to do that. You want to go ahead and start separating yourself from the rest of the field if you can. What? But you can't do it all in one fell swoop. It's hole by hole. Oh, whatever. I swung that insanely falls. fast. It's just about three feet away. If you know that the, um, the splash done. shot, That's if it's slow, will make it there, you kind of want it to be slow because the they stop really fast. Now off on this hole. Wow, I cannot believe I, I mean, I just forgot what I was saying. Slow. Okay, let's get those two important hit it. things Dang back. Dang it! Didn't hit the All right, so Join this one, if I hold it back, it needs to be faster line. than the but last round. Where they ended up, the the lie could have been a lot worse. I think they might be able to to deal with this without too too much trouble. Let's see if we can make this oh, with the update, maybe <laughs> with the highlights. It's not a hard putt to be honest. If I just ooh, ah. I didn't that put hurts. enough break on. I know I hit it. Just three feet to the cup. Um. Good putt, that. But yeah, with the update. Five under overall. Oh, Sung Sung JM ties us. Welcome to the tee at this par five hole. Go, go. Um, I believe that the update was supposed to slow. Uh, it's heading to the rough. I line. swung it faster than every shot I've hit. This round. The third hole at TPC Southwind, Rich, the first of the par fives on the golf course. A lot of water in play. You need to be brave if you're going for this in two. More golf balls hit into the water at TPC Southwind than any other golf course Whatever, on tour. Whatever, man. An excellent reason why you get a little careless. But, um, the water on the right -hand side it was supposed to maybe fix the highlight shot. reel where... I don't know, it was supposed to fix on it. But, um... Apparently it made it even worse because before oh, be good for the Let's make this it would show I like the, look of this. the person hitting, nice but show their end them. score. So if they were hitting, it would it would show shot you know four on the top this left. Um, that means they got a four on the hole, here. not they were hitting the four. And Look, they were constantly holding out from bunkers and chips, and is it was just happen. a bunch of weird stuff. To the next hole, but um, if not slow again. Yeah, you gotta. For some reason, on this round, you have to swing it insanely fast. For some reason. This would be a great up and down. Of course you would. You know, on a course where there's this much freaking water, and you would be scared to. Oh wow! Try to hit that slow. Oh, um, you'd be afraid to hit it fast. Well, I hope he makes this one. It's for par. Uh, yes. And there it is. Um, but apparently, and I was watching someone play, and that, now the commentators will not only on the say the wrong score par, most of the time, the but also the score that it shows is also wrong. <laughs> it's like the commentators will say. Okay. That's oh, into the rough, it's think. not, but like the Second this thing will say the... it's shot five. The commentator will say they got a birdie, but they got a four, which is a par. It's just funny. They try to fix something to make it a little worse. Wow. This one looks to be slightly offline here. And that lie, I guess. Shot.
and that lie. Hmm. Well, this is probably the uh, first bogey. The Guess we can hit a really good putt, which we do. And down she goes. <laughs> and it's worth taking another look uh. at that one. Oh, I gotta concentrate a little more. I would say that one did kind of smash it. He finds himself in a share of the lead. All right, Sung J M ties me yet again. We have a par four on this one. Perfect. Get over that tree. Oh man, I did not notice that. That's not what he had hoped Dang for. I'm pretty I didn't sure realize it was going to land Sitting at minus in a six, slope like that. Currently tied for top spot. But look at that. On the the club that it should honestly be affecting the yeah, most, which play. is a wedge. Well, the 11 mile an hour wind John, didn't move it at all oh. to the uh, left. Can make this one. It's for Thing just stayed right. Well, that hole's behind us. More to play. Also, that putt should have went in. There's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. You've arrived at a par four. Step up to the tee and own it. And after a par at the last, a chance to perhaps signal some intent. No harm, no foul there with that shot. Playing from around 190 yards out. Mm. Wind back into their grill. They need to flight this one I'm gonna down. fly that high. I'm going to use that wind. Opting for the hybrid, I think. That's how you use the wind right the there. Green. Still yeah, went too far, but that one. Up onto the green. there was no way you were up. getting that one close unless you just... Oh, how is there that much break? And I thought I was putting too much. Um, well hold, unless you did a perfect percentage shot, like a, you know, a 90, 96% on the three hybrid, the you know? Hole. Which still might have come up short because mine hit just before the flag and rolled too far. Um, we'll put right there with a little bit of D-loft and a lot of spin. Slow, of course. And look at how, look good, just look at how far right that far went. Right just... Wow, what a shot. Wind is absolutely swirling in Insane this Insane how far right course. that went. Wow. Oh, what a shame. Uh, that would have been a nice one to hold. So I moved it about, Let's what, 10, 12 feet next. left. The wind is mostly coming backwards. It's going a little bit to the right. I hit it just a teensy bit slow. We've reached the and Time to 30 feet right. It's crazy. Oh come on! I'm just getting John's down horrible the bounces. Do you have a look at this lie? I don't know how much of this one they can get. Uh, it ended up quite. Uh, and look quite at the um, rough. man. I was gonna say look at the wind not okay. take it there, but, the result, but at the end down. I guess it moved oh, as we can see there, the a wind ton. Definitely affecting that shot. Oh, that's the hands of a surgeon. Lovely touch. Judging it beautifully. All right. I mean, In she goes. still bogey it's free. The to 27 holes. And staying right where they were. But we're one back. After that. Always love a new beginning. Might be bogey free, but we're really not. Opening hole of the back nine, the tenth. Doing much? Wow, that was slow. All right. Well, sure luckily, the wind the kept it back. Opting for the six iron. Perfect. That's a pretty handy shot. Well, that's well played and sets up a good birdie look here at the tenth. Oh, Fair I was gonna good say, birdie. man, I and gotta read game. one of these correctly. Incredible. And that makes him tied for first. Oh, I always love these holes. Here we have a par three. Hmm. We're definitely going pitching wedge. We're going to deal off it a little bit. A tiny bit of that. Hit it perfect. 
Come on. Yes. Hit it perfect. Should have put some spin on it to have, get us some stop yeah, because we delofted it, but... Yeah, it's about 14 feet that's, the hole. you know... Good stuff today, especially that was a super, game. super risky really shot. We could have just taken, you know, a 9-iron, got it to the middle or back of the green. But that's what you get when you get go for the flag. Time to make a move. The tee is yours here at the 12th hole. Standing on this par 4 and leading... What's the strategy? Well, we're tied. Oh, man. The wind didn't do much there. Well, Rich, I'm being honest. This lie is putrid. Birdie on this hole yesterday, but highly Oh, God, this is a pitch. The lie they have today. I realized on the backswing that it was a pitch and made myself hit it really fast. This one's looking like 31 feet, I'd say. Stop breaking it. Come on. It's a good putt. Oh, see, that line was looking good, wasn't it? Looks like a pretty straightforward five footer to me. I thought we were hitting like a full so loft wedge or something. Eight. Currently eight under overall. Didn't even pay attention. That's why I really hate the um shot this suggestion. It's so stupid. The that should find the short stuff. Second shot here on the thirteenth hole. Mm. Told my hour and it's up here. We're gonna go full five. Hit it perfect. This oh one yeah. Like safely make the green. A wonderful shot. A chance for birdie here on the thirteenth. Almost a gimme birdie yeah, there. Yeah, if Luke. it was freaking straight. Look. Oh, I was gonna say. Nice look time. at how much Four that thing just curves. The leader now has a one-stroke advantage. We have a par three on this one. Oh, I say I know. Wow. Gorgeous. So that uh, 11 mile an hour wind just didn't well, do a, the target with that a damn one. thing. And missing it long with that approach, not a good Oh wow! One. Again, I was trying to go for a slow one. So it would go to the right well and hit that hill it's and kind of roll towards the hole, but it's not bad. He has this putt to save his not a bad leaf. Gets it to go down. Wow, what a save! Yeah, in the bunker, off the tee, great recovery. But that par three was you were not getting that thing close to the hole unless you attempted a. Uh, uh, I knew it was slow. Uh, this one might just and the wind the didn't fairway. bring it. Or keep it back as much as I Just thought. Off the fairway in the but first cut. yeah, that last yeah, hole was. This hole yesterday, but from easier circumstances today, a little more difficult, but still doable. Super tough to get it anywhere near the hole. Slow again somehow. If it was perfect, up, yeah, that would have been great. so good towards the hole. What an opportunity but to make a birdie. pretty straight putt, and, and we get another one. Fifth birdie of the day. Front nine, you know, we were looking like, man, are we gonna make a move at all? Are we gonna, are we gonna let him trail? Let us trail, or whatever. But uh, back now we kind of went, no, no. I'm gonna get in the rough a lot and still make birdies. You know, that's what that's what we said. I don't know if you guys remembered it, but it's definitely what I said. Yeah, I ain't getting there too, buddy. The hill at 16, bunkers on the front left and back right of this green could uh, pose well, some shoot, problems. Shoot, if it would have bounced However, a little more left, I could have. This hole generally plays the easiest on the golf course. Go ahead, take it on mm. the flagstick with your seconds. I think with the wind, you just ah. Oh, see, look, that one is one that I wanted perfect or a little fast. Went slow, but again, not. I mean, they aren't the worst leaves. Look at this that. Leaving ourselves pretty easy putts. Putt Two in a row there, Luke. Getting their groove on. Here we find ourselves on the table. And this is one we're There's definitely no going three wood. Positive vibes coming off that birdie. Let's and go slow into the heavier rough. Sometimes it's I'm still just not used to the difference of rounds. Well, I know that we're oh my God! Look at that! Not right up close to it, but it doesn't take a smart person to work out that's not mm -hmm. a nice lie. No, this is like hitting it into a head of cabbage. I mean, it literally is just awful. Getting ready to play their third. 
Look at that. Hopefully it sits. Not really. Man, that thing was going uphill the whole way, even on the green. That really shouldn't have rolled on so far. Oh, but we get the par. That's a good putt for par. You'll take it. And still One in top hole to spot. play. After that hole, keep it going. Alright, so left. this one. Okay, I, that's a good one. Looks like this one's hitting safe. I say we. C you can only be the tiniest bit fast on this hole and still be good. Straight down wind, tough to put a lot of spin on it and hold the green. Slow, God. This oh, one still a good shot though. Rush. I mean that. I don't know how it just died on the and fringe, but the third shot. make sure we don't hit it full and just played a little okay. bit too much break. Well, really, if we would have hit it even How's softer. Up here? And we and stay bogey putt, free for 36 holes and go six under on our second round. And through 36 holes, this player continues to shine out there in top spot. And I gotta say, it's a nice place to be, but if you look at the chasing pack loop, it is full of superstars. It is okay. So interesting. Second place is Sanjay M at eight under. And then well, Beyong Hun An is four Reeve, behind Reeve. him. And then we'll behind all. him is Tommy Fleetwood and two others. Four more shots behind. So really we're only competing with Sun J M and Beyong Hun An for the St. Jude Invitational. And really I would just say Sun J M. Because seven shots ahead is gonna be something, you know, I don't think that guy's gonna make up. Um, let's see, I think we will keep going, score par or better in a round, oh in a round of a PGA Tour event with 1.3 putts, okay, so I thought that was for the tournament, oh wow, okay. See, so I thought I played insanely well that tournament, and we're actually only one shot better than the last one. Our back nine was just really good. Back nine, we were five under. Front nine, we were only one under. Shut up, Luke. I don't feel like hearing you. I'm, a, I'm Mr. Cowboy right now. For the right. FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the WGC FedEx St. Jude Invitational is about to begin. Ooh, that was fast. Okay, so a little slower on this round, I think. Luke, he'll be alongside Rich Beam, and Rich, this player has been playing some impressive golf. They've got the lead. They're where they want to be, but what should be their mindset going into this round? Well, hopefully it's not on the chasing pack, because the chasing pack is filled with some big... There's names. only two so people even under par behind me, man. Down, focus on the task at hand. Doesn't matter if it's filled with big names, if they're all 12 shots back. Look at that. And, Can't wait to get into the and a bad drive. Okay, second shot, a little short, and we make a tremendous putt for well, Brady. Worth reviewing. Let's roll the video tape. Look at that. Twenty-five footer on the first hole. He sits in first position. I can't ever recall him making a birdie and feeling bad about it. So yes, birdie on the first. I don't know if you hit somebody in the head. Welcome to this hole. Off your drive, and you still make birdie. You can feel bad then, I guess. Yeah, he's we're going to swing it. For the cut stuff. Pretty slow. It feels like to get it. Second shot here on the second perfect. hole. Pitch. Max, almost max spin, I think. That was slow. Still on. Well, take notes, folks. Oh my god, That's I hate the shadows. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a star. Oh, it's hard putt because of the shadows, Just man. That through the line. Four feet to the cup. Yeah, good putt. We'll hold. 
is currently sitting in first place. Let's see what happens here at the third hole. At the third. Well, and then we're going to do another one of these. And now that was... Uh, this one might you got to really... Enough. I mean... Now, man on the ground, Holy. John McCarthy. What's this line look like, mate? Well, they ended up in the deep stuff, but uh, the lie could have been a lot worse. Yeah, but there's a tree in my way. That's the right option. Put it back in play. Getting ready to play their third. Hmm. Yeah, there we go. That. All right, this is pissing me off. I am swinging the pitches so fast. And they're still incredibly slow. Playing their fifth shot. This is making me really, really mad. Hmm. Well, they'd love a little bounce to the right here. Our first bogey. That's an absolute ripper. What a shot. Comes at the third round. And it's going to be a double bogey. On a par five. Coming up here. Because they don't know how to program pitches on. correctly. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after mm. that hole. Here we are. In Except they went from a five three. to a three shot lead. Opting for the five iron. Wow. Uh, I'm not sure that's what they okay. had in their mind. Well. That's Actually got a decent wanted. bounce, but I don't know how it was that he short. Managed to birdie this hole, this tournament. It's because it's a really difficult par three. Uh, par three is being the hardest to birdie Coming anyway. This one being a difficult one. Okay, let's head to the next. Needing a long-ish, mid to long iron the in. The pin being kind of tucked Your away. At a par four hole. Well, I like the look of the line here. They should find the fairway. Well, Rich, this looks like a familiar spot for this player. Yes, and let's hope it's not a similar result as yesterday. Pretty sure we birdied it. We just went into the rough over there. Oh, no, it was a par four. Never mind, we part it. That dog will hunt. All right, John. That's this very appropriate for our no, character right now. 22 feet to go here, guys. Oh, wow, okay. Ooh, so it really oh. didn't... Opportunity to make their par. The the break almost Jordan evened itself out. We only needed like a foot to the left instead of two, which is what I was thinking. I was like, Let's it breaks way more six. right than left, but it really didn't do much. That reminded me of the big easy, silky smooth. Well, I'm playing this one from around 120 yards out. Uphill with the wind. We'll just put some spin on this. And hit it slow, you know, like we do. So I might need to sit. And see, that's a, right up and a six mile an hour point. wind makes it go that far past the hole. And it's uphill eight feet on a wedge. But then when it's eight mile an hour in your face, it's 20 yards short. Makes no sense. There we go. Yeah, nice mid range birdie putt that one. And it's time to recap that play. And we're back to where we were at the beginning. Yeah, we don't need this one. It wasn't the toughest putt in the world. You just really had to get the speed right off the fringe, which I didn't. It went really. After that hole. It was, lead is getting bigger and bigger. it was really going to go way past Deep the hole. Into the front nine. Here we are at the seventh hole. This player's got some lovely momentum so coming up a birdie at the last. And straight into the trees. Well, Rich, <laughs> in the thick stuff here, not a good spot to be. Not as easy and straightforward as yesterday's par, so work to be done. Like they were swinging yep, right snake back into the, the golf club. And here we are with the third shot. Mm. Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. 
Well, let's see if we can. Well, not a bad approach that one up onto the green. A couple of putts from there, and that'll be a pretty good. Get call. it back, come on. There we go. Yeah, nice to make a mid range. That ball. was. <laughs> Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard after that effort. With the driver really not knowing, here. you know, really not knowing what to do. But look at that. Mr. I mean, look Joe's at that. In the seven iron. Ah, that one's heading out to the right. Never seen a scorecard that doesn't look good with a two on it. A little hard. Oh, oh excuse me, extremely hard. This putt about 11 feet in distance. This All one's right. online. Well, that's a momentum maintainer. Well done. Our current leader is up by three shots. Here we are at the final hole on the front nine. Bounce. Oh, come on. Ah, bit untidy, wasn't it? And John, what's this one looking like? Well, over here in the first cut, and it's not sitting too deep down in there, Dang. so... That fast didn't help us, but it was hard. It's really hard to judge. Getting ready to play um, third. What's going to affect it more? Your, you know, the slope or the wind? Oh wow, that one from the fringe actually oh, went he short. Did. Okay. Can't believe you did that. That drives you bonkers as a player. When you lag put well, to a foot we make the turn to the on a nine? six foot break. So far? Yeah, but I, I like the position. I like being out in front. It forces the other players to come catch you. I like their position. That's uh, hitting to the rough for mine. Yeah. I tried to only hit it um, the second shot at the you know, like 90 some percent power, but hard to do and hit it perfect as well. Going with the ah, it's going to bounce left. Well, roll left, I guess. But not a bad approach. No, not bad It'll at all. Putting. Little right, little left. A few today, and this little left hill. Good look. Straight in. And another one goes. And with it, all right. An increase of his lead. Let's get back to, you know, playing decent. Once today. we hit, we hit that double, and it just kind of was like, all right, right let's take a step back. And let's see if they can deliver another one. Really try to figure this out. Okay, I'm going to say if this is slow, it's not going to make it. Oh, and look at that. Little bounce to the right here. Oh, that's a great shot. And a birdie opportunity coming up here at the 11th. And with that, that's their fourth birdie. Kind of like it. Two in a row. He's feeling it. Always positive coming off a birdie. Let's see what happens here. Whoops. This hole is so important at this critical time. Go for it. Okay. Lay it back. How much do you trust your swing? <laughs> right now with the driver, I mean, I don't trust it too much, but I guess I, I do trust it enough. Don't trust the pitches, though, because they are absolute dog crap. They make no sense. This is one of those lengthy putts. And the funny thing is I kind of had them down before, but like... A strong 40 feet to the, to the cut from here. And they'll walk away with a par on this one. Let's take a look at oh, the man. And now that finds him in first place. And now teeing off on this par four hole. Bounce left. Oh, bounce straight. You like that, didn't you? And they're playing from about 140 yards out. Uphill six feet, down seven. I think this should be good, honestly. Slow like always. Let right. That's I mean, a bad error to make there. That's it. Uh, right. Didn't quite strike that as clear. But as I did have the line. distance correct. Oh, a little shorty baker on that action there. Right. Well, that's an impressive little chip. You better believe it is great stuff to watch. And in it goes for the par. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard. After that. All right, getting into our final stretch. Time to tee off here at the 14th. 
a lot of spin. Put a lower and play a tiny cut. Or just hit it fast and left. This one looks like it's uh. going left. This would be a momentum saver here, getting this up and down. Mm, okay. Playing that spin actually had it stop. Did we want it to? Apparently not. Because we bogeyed. Uh. So after avoiding the drop shots, that's their first bogey. Our leader is currently I mean, enjoying yeah. Except for that double advantage. we had. The honor is yours. Time to hit a good one here at the 15th. Oh, that's a sweet Tried to go by 95. But, no, that's fine. The lines aren't too bad here in the first cut of rough. Well, look, they birdied the hole yesterday. Good luck today on repeating that birdie. <laughs> Especially in the water, right? Just a bit outside. Oh, wow. We got lucky. And here we are with the third shot. Wow. This one just outside seven feet to the hole. Well done. Now four shots up after that hole. Well, this is easily the worst round. Time to take advantage. Oh, that is a thing of beauty. That we've played so far. Of the three. The final par five at TPC Southwind is a good one. Up the hill, Rich, and a chance to get there in two. Hmm. Second shot back up the hill at 16. Bunkers on the front left and back right of the screen. Could yeah, slow. pose some problems. Oh, guess However, that worked out. this hole generally plays the easiest on the golf course. Go ahead. Take it on the flagstick with your seconds. Plays this the easiest because it's shorter. It, might even have it would seem. Than two of the par fours. Uh, a bit long on that one. This putt coming up is for birdie. Mark it down. That's birdie number five. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Oh. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Gives a good chance to maintain the momentum. This one looks to be Tad a bit of a push, but that puts it in the middle of the fairway. This shot coming from around 220 yards. This shot is longer than the last. Well, oh yeah, we we did use a three wood instead of a driver, so I can't guess I can't say that. <laughs> Quality shot that one. Oh, this is a long way from downtown, but you're closer, John. What's he got in front of him? Ooh, what do I got in front of me? I hold it. From here. Well, that's worth a replay. Let's take Is it though? I mean, it wasn't the hardest putt ever, you know. I think it was kind of long. Well, I mean, 28 foot. This is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. Okay, and Sun J M right. apparently eagled that hole. Because I believe we're playing together. Oh, good drive. That one should find the fairway. Don't you love it when they eagle par fours that take at least a f hard five iron in? Like, oh. With the Whatever, we're still here. Well, that certainly makes putting a lot easier when you can hit a shot like that. Absolutely. In there close. Good look at Birdie coming up. Got it. And that signs off on today's round. All right. Uh, I'm in four under. So we went five, six, four. Well, this is lovely play. And it just we just had a double and a bogey. I mean, so. Good play, Rich. That's crazy because that means with the double and bogey finishing at four under, that means with no bogeys would have finished seven under, so it would have been our best um, round. And we're three ahead of Sun J M, nine ahead of Beyond Hun An, and nobody else really matters because they're too far away. And we got that club. 
I guess it's a new wood. We can check that out. I think it's a wood, let's see. No, so it must be a hybrid. And we hit our three hybrid 208, which actually isn't bad compared to our other ones. It's seven yards shorter than our five wood, and 12 yards, no, uh, 13 yards longer than our five iron. So it's a, a good little mid thing. No? Then what the hell? It wasn't a driver, was it? The smallest club head of it, yeah. Oh, the club head just looks tiny. So less, much less distance. Better shot shaping, forgiveness, and distance control, but that swing plane, holy hell. No thank ya. Cause we're actually doing, we're doing decent with our driver once we figure it out. But that's the thing is figuring it out. We need some better wedges too, cause holy hell. Even less distance? Wow. Could you imagine hitting it even less distance? Okay. So these are decent. Of course, they're golf club clubs because they have to be the best. These tailor made Sim Maxes are decent. Same with the Callaway Jaw. Bridgestone's okay. I don't think you really need much shot shaping with a wedge. Whoa, but apparently these Bridgestone's are all about the shot shape. I like these Callaway jaws. Distance for give, uh, shot shaping and swing plane. Oh wow. Ooh, but I want these. The P790, because that's actually, that's the new club that I got. Oh, we can buy those? Oh, you can just buy them. Really, I can't... Oh wow, they don't have a um, love wedge. Our pitching wedge still goes nine yards shorter than mine. Just give me all the frickin' wedges. Oh, there we go. Equip club sets. There. Really? No? Just don't have it, I guess. Oh, so they only have it <clears throat> in that one. So, what do they have? So for a 54 degree sandwich, I, I, I kind of want all my irons to be tailor-made because that's what they are. 
in real life. And so that means we just have to unlock them. Okay. Yeah, we'd have to unlock the sim. But I really like this. Well, we're missing the sandwich. And the loft wedge. We're gonna go 60 degree with the loft wedge. There we go. And we can get these. Oh, it's less distance? And... What? This makes no sense. Okay, so we're getting five yards less with our main irons now. Um, God, and this is what I hate. Like, these are honest, honestly, the tailor made irons are top two or three iron sets right now. These are. Um, but somehow they aren't some of the best in the game. I, don't, I just don't understand that. It's so stupid. And this one we need to unlock with um, sponsor. Yes, the three hybrid. Oh my god, our three hybrid goes insanely further than our five one. <laughs> Uh... Oh, here we go. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, what's going on? Okay, there's so driver 288, 3 wood 248, 5 wood 230, 3 hybrid 224, 5 iron 190, 6 180, 7 170, uh, 8 161, because, you know, that's an insanely odd number, 9 iron 152. So, for me in real life, driver, I can't hit it 288, unfortunately, but 3 wood, 5 wood, don't know about a 3 hybrid. Um, the 5 iron, I think I can get to 195. Um, 
six iron, I can get a little bit further. Seven iron, I can get a little bit further. Eight iron, same thing, like an extra five yards. So six iron, 185, seven, 175. Eight, 165, nine, 155. Pitching wedge, 145. Um, gap wedge is correct. Sand wedge is correct. Loft wedge is correct. Hell yeah. That's gonna make this episode super long. Well, let's go ahead and finish it off. And see how we do with our clubs. Hopefully we don't mess it up. I mean... We have a decent lead. What are we? What do we have? A five shot lead? I don't know. I can't move. UK Sports and the PGA Tour proud to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. We're at the World Golf Championships FedEx St. Jude Invitational. Today's coverage is about to start. Pleased you could join us for this final round action. Luke Elvey here with Rich Beam in the booth and Rich it's the final round in this one. What's our next player dealing with as they start their round? Well, they start off with a very small lead, and so they're going to be cognizant of that. There's not a lot of room for error, but in saying that, they do have the lead, so they can't afford to make a mistake somewhere along the line if it should happen to come up. But in saying that, they just don't want to make any mistakes. It's going to be a difficult day all around. Let's get down to the action. I forgot I had no hat on this one. See this one go down. And we so birdied the it. first with 12 mile an hour winds in our impressive. face. That settles the nerves right there. Great. Oh, stuff. we had a four shot lead. That's right. And now it's it's still a four. Can't birdie them all unless you birdie the first, Luke. Good start. This hole here is a par four. Nice birdie back there. On to the next. Of course it's slow. Because if it was a little bit fast, it would have been perfect. John, you're down there. How's this ball line? Not great. Well, guys, they're in the deep stuff here. And they did get a favorable lie considering the situation. Let's see what happens. Little pull. Oh, man. Come on, sit. Well, would have been long, I think, if we... No, it would have been perfect if we hadn't pulled it. Still counts. Slim chance for a birdie. But in all reality, two putt for par would be just... Wow. Yeah, a bit long on that one. Seven feet to the cup. Wow. That was a gallant attempt. Apparently those Lovely little coming up here. breaks are just insane and we and give it away. It give away the, the first hole. Currently 15 under par for the event. Teeing off here at the third hole. There was literally, I mean there was hardly any break in that. That was slow of course. This one should find and it broke rough. an incredible way right. Ooh, sometimes you need a hacksaw to get out of this rough. Good option. Take your medicine and try and get it up and down from there. This spot looks awfully mm -hmm. familiar. Didn't they play here yesterday? Same spot as yesterday. Will they have the same results today? What I do that day? Oh my God! That's not the outcome they're after. Air mailed the green with that approach. This line doesn't look too tough. Just in the first cut, up right by the green. Well, and unfortunately, crazy, on a par five, we get yes. we walk out with a par. Very smooth tempo there on that chip. So we had a birdie bogey par. Currently 15 under par. Three ahead. T is yours. Here we are at the fourth hole. I can't believe they're not even going to talk about the fact that I switched clubs in the middle of a round or a tournament. Oh my God! What the hell? Swung it pretty fast, to be honest. This would be a great up and down. Go ahead and make it. Thought that would have went a little further. Oh, save it coming up for this fella. Looking good. Oh, wonderful effort. Confirms the par. Our leader is a couple of shots up at this stage. You are allowed to switch. Here we have a long par. Oh, just not in the middle it's of a round. Two great shots to get on. 
I think uh, was it Phil Mickelson switched. Um, oh man, I don't know why I didn't realize that was rough right there. This is not a good place I'm to an be. Idiot. Yes, difficult light made a par here yesterday. A little bit more difficult today. Oh wow. Okay. Going with the hybrid. This one looks to be a tad wayward. For some reason, I thought it was fairway. Ready to play their third. Uh. Wow. <laughs> and here we are with their four. Oh my God! Was that to going down? Your nine foot chance here. For another bogey. Mm. Ooh, that looks like a it's an insanely poor hole. Every single thing, it was slow. Then yeah, fast. Two shots up after that one. Almost perfect chip. Time to tee off at the sixth. I mean, it's with the wind. It's hard to do anything, or hard to judge anything. I should say, judge that one perfectly. Though. Pretty good shot there. From about 100 yards. Wind's blowing from left to right. They really want me to hit these pitches. And hook this one in the wind to slow the golf ball down. Trying to get it to a little, move a little bit to the left guess. here. And this putt is for birdie three on the scorecard. Bam. Making this look easy. All right, so in. even for the rounds. And after that performance, they'll stay right where they are in the standings. Oh. And they increase no, the lead. No, we don't. This is impressive, Luke, but can they we stay hold where we this are. play? Oh, no, it, we did well increase done. it. That was a birdie. This shot is about 140 yards out. Wind's blowing right to left here, and they're going to go ahead and ride mm. the one in here. 138, 136. Yeah. If it's not slow, which it is, Looks like they're going with the pitching wedge. it would have been perfect. Like it caught up in the brush here. It's fair to say that wasn't their best shot. Oh, the wind wreaks havoc with another yeah, golf ball. Yes, to say it was the wind. Oh. No a little far with that one. This oh one my nice God. This one's and we give here. it and back again. Let's have a look at the contenders. And the pretenders still in the lead now. After that, only hole. by two though. Just a couple of plays. Can't give this nine. one away. Is the tee shot at the eighth? Looking to bounce back after that bogey at the last. That was a pretty. Hopefully Jesus. this one is better. This one's bunker bound. This would be a great up and down from this spot. I swung that so fast. Okay, so that's step one. But now gonna hold a mid-range putt. Oh, what a stroke! Yeah, nothing to sweat over that one. We'll hold. Leading by a couple after that hole. Teeing off here at the ninth hole. Carpet. No. They got caught up in a few of the branches. Well, man, man what is with the, the frames? That I swear that line. update they did made this. Well, heads up here, guys. I don't really know how much bad. this one's going to come out of this stuff. Very, very deep, deep down in here. Chosen the pitching wedge here. Ooh. Is that right? I think so. That was what we call a, a happy shot. accident. In the birdie range here at the ninth. And this has been a hole he's unable to take advantage of so ah. far for this event. Three feet to go here to the hole. I even made myself push that to the right in our Ooh, first nine over par. Rich, but luckily, Sun JM bogeys well, his as well. Hands to yourself, but yes, this player is definitely dialed in at the moment. No, I'm not. It's the worst I've played so far. Looks like they put a good swing on that one. That should find the short stuff. This one from about 160 yards out. Wind is blowing right to left here, and they're going to go ahead and ride the wind back. No, I'm not, pin. because that would mean make, hitting a cut into a pin where there's only like two or three feet on the green, on the left side of the green. Opting for the nine iron. 
Nothing good out on the right-hand side, Luke. This had to really? be trouble. Always love these opportunities, especially when it's for birdie. Short game has it been broke more to the right than the left. It only broke left right at the beginning. He's got a and it broke right at the last three it. feet. I didn't and move it. How did it well, stay out to the left? Hmm? Our leader How? Is enjoying a three -stroke advantage. You tell me. This hole is a par three. Too bad, bitch. And after that par, they're looking for something good here. Hmm. Eight iron, D loft. Oh, we pulled it, but Still that's okay. Opted for the eight iron. Oh wow! Well. Shouldn't have deal off that it is it so much. Really a comfortable shot for no, them, it actually it? was. Yeah, it took a bit too much club on that one. Sit. Nah, that just good don't sit. Time. Yeah. Just ten feet to the cup here. It's got a chance. Nicely hold, and for par. He's currently sitting in first place. Teeing off here on the twelfth hole. Do you attack it and try and increase your lead, or do you lay back and play Ooh. safe? I like to attack it. What do they like to do? Where did that come from? That's not his style. Yes, it is. Oh, the old fried Not what an bad lie. It's Any just the wind. This one? And that ball really dug into this ball. Wow, went right. Uh, she's deep, boys. She's deep. Nicely done. Man, just think if we hadn't have put it that far out to the right, where it would be. Oh, I pushed it. But it needed oh, so way close. more, apparently. Just a four footer remaining. Man. Ooh, nice looking putt. Putting was decent the first three rounds, but we can't get anything to drop in this one. Leads back only to two. Let's see what happens here at the thirteenth. Wow. Seems like they got an abundance that was slower than any drive I've hit so far. Yet it was the fastest one. To play from the bunker. Yeah, they parred this hole yesterday, but from easier circumstances today, a little more difficult, but still doable. Come on, wind. That's uh, heading into the rough, I think. Mm. And here we are with the third shot. There we go. Yeah, that's some golf, particularly from that terrain. Well hold. Let's move on. Now right, we got five holes to go. Maintaining top spot on the so we need to birdie at least two that. to make sure we it's time to guarantee a win. Hole. Which yeah, I made sure I didn't go slow. Well. <laughs> this one headed left. I don't care. That's fine. This would be a momentum oh. saver here, getting this up and down. Should we putt it, chip it, splash it? Oh, I tried it. Oh, uh, that was stupid. And that was falling apart. We give away the lead right here. Playing their fourth shot. Actually, I hit it the perfect freaking percentage. Wow. <laughs> oh, yeah, just go off the green. Oh, my God. Maybe you can chip it back close and limit the damage. Well, the It didn't break. And this one's for quadruple bogey. And there it is. Our current leader is up by three shots. <laughs> Teeing off here at the 15th mm. hole. Why wouldn't that? Why wouldn't that have happened? You know. Well, well played. Around 110 yards to go. Only a few shots off the pace. Why would that not have happened? Well, that was over. -clubbed. How? 10 mile an hour wind. I didn't even put that much steel on. Definitely the wind had to have gotten a hold of that one. Yeah, he's back on the surface. Happy to have the flat stick in hand. Pretty good chance here. This one's for par. I just. I make it. I have three holes to go and I can't win. And I was in the lead by four. Teeing off here on the 16th hole. 
and I'm calling bullshit Come on, that with that putting. Let's power towards it. Why, and you're on the fringe, Looks like a if you go yesterday. the percentage it wants you to, is it going to go past the hole 12 feet when it's uphill the entire f mm. Wow. I have to eagle birdie, birdie, and it that makes it only a tie if the other person pars the entire thing, and that somehow didn't break left at all, even though it broke left 70% of the way. Oh no, they just, now they go on a birdie run. They've birdied three of the last three. That should find the cut stuff. Playing this shot from about 170 yards. Makes me honestly feel like quitting right now. blowing left to right. Going to try and hold it against the wind. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. Yeah, because of course that was slow. Running up the birdie putt here. Was on a good line. Yeah, it's just about three feet away. Solid par putt, that. He's currently in the second position. Well, it's come down to this the <laughs> final hole. Welcome to the 18. Slow. Well, that should find the bunker. John's down on the course, and do you have a better look at this lie? Well, they should be able to deal with this. I think it's ended up sitting pretty good here in the sand. Oh, don't even know anymore. This is and just poor shit. Shot. Four strokes off the lead. Lovely touch. Well played. Just eyeballing that one, trying to make it. Poor so shit on that 14th hole, it really was, here. won't lie. Rich, not a bad week, but so close to the win. Second <laughs> place, Luke? Yeah, it, it's nice, but what could have been? I think that's going to eat at the player. Well, on behalf of myself, Luke Elby, and Rich Beam, thanks for tuning in. Catch you tomorrow. That was a complete horse shit. We didn't get the sponsor, so... Yeah, see, we would've won that, we would've passed Patrick Cantley. Oh. Sorry this long episode's ending on a sour note, but the next one is the John Deere Classic. Then we have a major the Royal Championship, which is basically the Open. Uh, I don't remember if I said this is... I don't think this is actually a major, because, yeah, it's a real tournament, it's not a major, but... I guess it's just a big tournament. But. We have... John Deere Classic, then a major, then we have the 3M Open and the Tributary Championship, then we go into the FedEx Cup Playoff last three rounds so three four five six seven seven more uh tournaments anyway hope you guys enjoyed it sorry for that sour one hole but bye